Yo, yo, what's up, everybody? This is Prophet Gaming here, and we're back with part 13 of A Plague Tale Innocence. So I was thinking, um, I think it's Amicia, uh, one of the main characters of the game. If they ever turn this into a movie, I think Natalie Portman would probably be, be the best choice to play her character. But that's just my opinion. Anyway, guys, let's get into it. Part 13, you know? It's called Penance. So someone's gonna have to repent. That's right, Hugo ran off. Where Isn't that what happened? Where can he have gone? Where could he have gone? Think, Amicia. Think. Think, Amicia. Think. Think. Is that a, a, a village here? It was like the same village we was at in the beginning. Hey, wait. Did anyone see a child come through here? Please. Oh, Amicia. Is she feeling better? Is she dreaming? Lovey? Is, is, is that you? Have you seen Hugo? Did you shout at him again? No, absolutely not. Times are hard enough already without you two arguing. But we hmm. weren't arguing anymore. Amicia, a child never runs away without a reason. Hmm. Open the door. I'm going to find him. All right, but be careful. An ill wind is on its way, Amicia. Hold on, woman. This ragdoll, he never would have left it behind like this. Right. <clears throat> I think she's dreaming, honestly. Mm-hmm. Thanks, old lady. What the hell? What is that? What is going on? Amicia. Is that really you? Where is Hugo? He... he's gone. <gasps> I knew this would happen. I did take care of him. Then why did he leave? I, I don't know. I... I did everything I could to protect him. Even... horrible things. It is easy to spill blood. But to love, to protect... I'm going to find him. Then go. And pray there is still time. Hmm. Hugo, that's him. Hmm. Mother? Amicia, Mom? come here. Yes, Mother. Your brother's here. How is he? If he's back, it's because he's not very well. Mm. But I did everything. You hid the truth from him. But... His emotions, Amicia. I warned you. Let me see him. He doesn't want to see you. Who are you talking to, Mommy? I have to see him. He doesn't need you anymore. That's a lie. Go on then. See for yourself. Hugo. Hugo, are you alright? No. What's the matter? Why did you leave? Why didn't you tell me mommy was alive? It was for oh. your own good, Hugo. That's not true. You didn't want me to know. Don't say that. You're jealous. Jealous. Let go of me. Hugo, go. Damn. She got knocked out. Uh, Hugo. Uh, where are you? Oh, shoot. Y'all heard that? Yo, this music. Hugo. Let me go. He's there. Thank you. Stop shouting. Hugo, it's over. They about to pull out. Hey, are you alright? They didn't hurt you, did they? No. But why did you go off oh. like that? I heard mommy. She was calling me. It must have been a nightmare, that's all. I really thought it was her. 
She was in pain, and she can't feel pain where she is now. We talked about this. But what you tell us is in the truth. Yeah. You have to accept it. Let's go back. All right. We must get back to the castle. Why don't you just be honest with him? This music, though, is pretty dope. What is that? Oh, those are crows. Ka, ka. Wait, I'm sure it's mommy. What? It's coming from over there. We have to go. No, you're not going. But why? <coughs> Let go of me. Hugo. I'm coming, mommy. Come back. Why don't you just be honest and tell him the truth? Why she gotta lie to him? It's kind of messed up. No, Hugo. There, she's in there. Hugo. Mommy. Stop! It's not her. Oh shit. No, no, Hugo. Is she still dreaming? Yeah, she's still dreaming. No. Shut up. Let go of me. The music, though. I did it for him. And I'll kill you again if I have to. I'll kill all of you. Oh. Oh, no. Not them. No. Hugo, is that you? Wow. She's drowning in rats. Damn, bro. That's so disturbing. Only eight minutes. <coughs> it is done. Is it? Can I go and see my mother now? Only the Grand Inquisitor may say. But you told me. My words <clears throat> are of <clears throat> no importance. Only those of the Grand Inquisitor. Or Hugo. But be sure, you are very precious to him indeed. Hmm. Here you go. So I'm Hugo now? Out. Let me. I'm Hugo, guys. I have to find mommy. Oh. Oh man. Stop. <clears throat> wow. Okay. <clears throat> Four nights in a row I've been on Epicentre duty. When's it gonna end, <coughs> eh? Soon. The hour of the conjuration approaches. Think of Vitalis. Your ordeal is nothing compared to his. What am I supposed to do? <coughs> hmm? Four nights in a row I've been on epicenter duty. When's it gonna end, eh? Soon. The hour of the conjuration approaches. People. Think of Vitalis. Your ordeal is nothing compared to his.
Am I supposed to go in there? Smooth. Oh, so big. Where's mommy? Material of materials. Gold unique. By breaking you, I clear your to the blood of the chosen one. Today's refining gun. The quality is excellent, but the mass of raw epi sandwich is decreasing. Our harvesters are being decimated by the rats. Do your best. The life of the Grand Inquisitor depends on the quality of the distillate. Attack his mind. Don't worry. The boy's blood will restore the powers equilibrium. And his soul emerge unscathed. Add me. Add Luca. smooth It will soon be necessary to change the filters and scrape the tank. Twenty pounds. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so. Because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such quantities of Episanguis. His faith protects him. It protects us all. What is this? Ah, uh, come on, man. <coughs> hey down there. The distillate is thickening. It will soon be necessary to change the filters and scrape the tanks. All this stealth, man. Sucks. 20 pounds. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so. Because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such hey. one. Afraid. Not afraid. Not afraid. Not afraid. the conjuration. Are you on the list? Yeah. I'll be on the square in front of the cathedral. Oh, so you'll be right next to the Grand Inquisitor when he frees us. And I'll be stuck here. We'll all meet again afterwards. The end of the bite. It's going to be quite a party. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
I get past that. Oh, he has to walk by. Or I have to walk by. Nice. Metal Gear Solid, man. You guys are playing that. Like Millie. Oh, the smoke will definitely help me. That's dope. Smoke it out. <clears throat> Let's get it smart. That's enough. I demand to see the talent now. The Grand Inquisitor is very busy. Me? <clears throat> I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. Mm. I see here only heresy and occultism. And you, you all. <clears throat> Shut up. Your rank should make you Where are you? Madness. Nice. <clears throat> Magister, the text clearly mentions the ascension of a child during the great plague of Justinian. I knew it. The Roman nobles isolated him from the people and worshipped him in secret. Maybe an ancestor of Hugo de Rune. Continue. They're talking about me. By freeing the country from the bite, the Grand Inquisitor will gain the adoration of the people, and with it, unprecedented political power. Archbishop Gautier's presence here says a lot. The Pope's court is worried. And so they should be. Serves them right for not intervening earlier. Huh? What? Mm -hmm. Uh huh? The Prima Macula, on the cusp of the first threshold, devours the lost. The Prima Mama, what? Or walks beside the one who tames it. Master <clears throat> or slave, order or chaos. <clears throat> but how can we be sure? Keep it stepping, fool.
The Atrista Rune's research texts are all coded. I give up. I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's going to crack. About time. Mommy. Wash your toes, man. Wash your toes. What is he doing? What's that? Oh, uh, come on. <coughs> How did he see me? The Atrista Rune's research texts are all coded. I give up. I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's going to crack. About what? time. How is he seeing me? Ow. All right, let me see. The Atrista Rune's research texts are all coded. I give up. I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's <clears throat> going to crack. About time. Move your crusty behind out of here, bro. Good as toes. Come on. Be stepping, bro. Thank you. Cow, it's later, man. You see, Amicia, I found mummy. What's over here? What's popping off over here? She's in the basement, they said. I have to keep going down. So how do I get there? Let's find out. Grand Inquisitor, the Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Prefect. Bring him in. <clears throat> Italis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. Mm. And all this is... But if I may, it's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Rune. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monsignor. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. Hmm. Proceed. It's disgusting. Mm. 
That's enough. You play the martyr. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mm. mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Vitalis Benevon, you are to be excommunicated. <laughs> One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. <laughs> but not a saint. Your inquisition is over. Meaning that a new era commences. One where puppets such as yourself will kneel puppets. and beg me to save them. Is with us. Very good. Go and see whether Beatrice de Rune has regained consciousness. Mm. He's scary, but I have to follow him. Why does she keep resisting like that? We have the same goal. Both fight the plague. Only our methods differ. The daughter is making the same error. <sighs> Stupid. But the brother, he is unique. He might understand. Unique? I'm unique. At ease. Ad ignem. Ad lucem, sir. So, you saw the Grand Inquisitor? Yes. The blood of the carrier flows through his veins. The conjuration will take place. Splendid. The end of the plague is nigh. Indeed. But do not lower your guard. What was that? Nothing. Hmm. All right. Okay. Put a bomb. The garden, the sky. I can't see the sky. Congratulations on capturing the child. We've been after him for weeks, and then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor that he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her? Too smooth with it, man. Oh no, another way. Right. Okay. Captain, <clears throat> uh, I was told that the carrier of the Maximus is that right? The guy has turned himself in. As I was telling you, this guard was devoured. But not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what mm -hmm. purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, at the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. Just a matter of time. Uh, his rats. Uh, tell me. Why can't I eat? Where is he? I won't find man without him. You have nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention a 
radical change of diet. Uh, hey, kid. Good. Help me. No. Help me. What's wrong with him now? Hey, no. Die quietly. We're trying to work here. I'd rather he waited a few months. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you. You'll all go to hell. You and your fucking rats. Save us this rest. He's going to kill me. Your death <laughs> is not an end. For your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children. Your pride. It's horrible. Her son with a knife to his throat. She'll go blind. Is that right? So Lord Nicholas go past. That the rune woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. Ah, serves her right. Ah, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh no, she's way too stubborn. But no match for our foot. Like it out there, believe me. At least here, your carcass can still be of value <clears throat> to our alchemists. Sink yourself, Lucky. Oh, bastard! Hey, kid, what the hell are you doing here? Answer my questions. Or perhaps you are still upset about what happened to your husband. Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. Go if they find you here. No, I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo. Did they take your blood? Oh uh -oh. my god. Uh oh, spaghetti. -o. All right, Hugo. We'll go together. But you have to find the keys. Where's the keys at? They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? Hmm. Cheer. Off you go then. Go. Go get them keys. Be very careful. Come back as soon as you have the keys. Alright y'all, that's the end of this part in the series. Um, I will definitely pick this back up ASAP. We're gonna get those keys, baby. Let's get it. Peace. <laughs>